It was good, y'all. All right, here you see me trying to cut up this video from yesterday's stream. Um, I try to cut out as much as the boring bits, like me running through the menu and readjusting my settings because I had to do that a lot in yesterday's stream. Um, my biggest concern for this game right now, at least before its official release date, which is on the 10th tomorrow, um, is that the performance requires a lot. Uh, it's drawing a lot of resources from my computer. Uh, I think my biggest issue is my 16 gigabytes of RAM. I'm going to have to double it for 32. Um, it was fine for any other game I play, but for this one specifically, it requires pretty much all of it and more. So um, I have some on order. It's going to be here probably by Sunday. Um, hopefully by then I'll be able to stream the game again and play it. Um, for now, I'm just going to try to record and post. You'll see if you watch the rest of this video, um, there's a lot of stuttering going on. And I try to cut out the most most of it, but some of it's some stories and details, and it's perfectly understandable if you don't want to watch it. Um, it's just for you know, for a few of my friends who do want to see me play through it. Um, and that's pretty much the biggest thing. Hopefully, though, like I said, in the future we get these issues um, sorted away. And my apologies if you have to, your eyes start bleeding after having to watch some of this. Uh, you can see I cut through a lot. Um, of the boring bits like i said and try to keep some of the more more entertaining parts um we'll get this down packed in the future uh start pushing these videos out as soon as possible obviously i work full time and i have a family so i'm a, i'm very late to the uh the content as for all the other youtubers who are able to push them out like literally three days before the game even comes out um but this is just for fun this is for me and um, i'm just trying to do what i can with it hopefully y'all uh, y'all enjoy it though go ahead and uh if you did enjoy my attempt at making this video y'all um, hit the like button and subscribe and i'll catch y'all later peace out let's go ahead and try to get into this we are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted to hogwarts school witchcraft and wizardry as a fifth year student term begins on 1 september preliminary supplies have been collected for you and will accompany you on your journey to the castle as you may be aware the create reasonable restriction on underage sorcery prohibits the use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside the school however due to your unique circumstances the ministry has graciously agreed to allow Professor Eleazar, Eleazar, Fig, to help you hone your spells, hone your spell casting before you esc escorting you from London to the castle for the start of the term feast ceremony. All right, cool, Professor Weasley. Oh yeah, forgot about this. Hmm. Who do we look like? <laughs> I feel like I have a, a round head. More like a box head, right? Who has a boxy head? He has a pretty box head. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's get it started in here. Take a picture from my Snapchat real quick. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate. Let's take a picture. Work. Like he closes his eyes. George, glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... <clears throat> best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm -hmm. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. 
After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. London, Big Ben. I'm excited, man. Let's go. Let's go. I want to see if I can maintain like above 60 with the ray tracing on. If I can, I'll lock it in at 60, depending on how, how high it is. Glad I caught you before you left for Scotland. <laughs> Just barely. <laughs> And who is your traveling companion? A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. How did you wait? We do. Man, what? I did not expect that to happen. Are you alright? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Are we about to get into it right now? Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second.
what happened. Poor George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. I'm trying to turn my tracing. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you think the port key was meant to lead us there? I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Mind your step. Dude, this game looks crazy. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by, and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. <clears throat> But, sir, why was your wife searching for evidence? I'm so lost at like just magic. looking around, like all Miriam the. wanted to understand why such powerful the magic game disappeared looks like and from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do, but magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Oh gosh. How do I do that? Excellent! Use your camera to select the target. Okay. Makes sense. There's like no crosshairs, but you just look around and it selects. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Is it using like a mana system or anything? No, it just... Your one works improving with every cast. 
Thank you, sir. Bro, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> Just be whipping that one. Let's go. All right, let's come on. Let's go. Ah, up there. I wonder if they have anything in these vases. I feel like. Can I hit the birds? Imagine. Like, he's going that way, but I feel like you have to go this way real quick. Just see if there's anything back here, right? And I was rewarded for my curiosity. A little 60 coins. You, you have to break every vase. You just have to. We're close now. It's just ahead. Steady yourself. Repair. Crazy. Almost there. <laughs> I have to break all the bases. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That portkey led us here for a reason. I turned on the sharpness now. Let's have a look now. around for anything that seems. Things too sharp now. Out of place. Mini map shows the surroundings: the purple arrow in the middle and the. Okay, cool. Professor, this statue... This may have been his home! Okay. It's a mural of some kind. Hmm. Perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. so many vases i'm tempted to break them but like that enchanted crystal i'd be here all day but what could it be blocking what's this professor fig do i wait for him uh, oh wait i can't go inside never mind Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? A game got laggy for a second. How is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. 
wake the goblin? What do I do? Hello? Just a moment. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> uh, where are we here? <clears throat> if anyone was in the stream, can you tell me if it's really laggy or not? Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key? White's porky. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. <whistles> After you. Inside the cart, if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> How many volts are there in Great Courts? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You'll want to take a breath. A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. My bad. I had myself. In that muted. time, no one has visited Vault to 12. Lock my frames yeah, at 75. Today. So I don't have to in case I dropped up many frames again. I don't want my stream to like lag out. Vault 12. We're playing on max Thank settings you for your help. with ray tracing on while streaming. It's not bad. Doing pretty good.
This game looks really good. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! Best of luck. <sighs> Professor, that was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm, Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Hmm? So steady your wand and guide it along the symbol's path and learn the spell and the corresponding input. I'm confused. Wait, I do this again. Boom, boom. Okay, I see how it works now. What do I do? Okay. Rebellion. Was that just to learn it or something? There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. There's a the chest back there. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Let's investigate. Lumos! This is no ordinary on. vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. I urge to wander off into the darkness. <laughs> oh no. Revelio. Maybe there's a chest on I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. It's calling my name. When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio? Revelio! I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Oh. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, go, 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 go. Bro, what is this thing chasing me right now? What the heck? It's like a little red. You required the one lighting charm, Lumos. Okay. Sounds good to me. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Oh. 
Hey, Professor Fig. Going crazy. Uh huh. Uh huh. No, I click. I click. I click the button. Okay. I need to move my binds around a little bit. Review the objectives to reveal the way forward. Oh, I have to block three. Okay, so I'm not supposed to destroy them. I'm supposed to block. Alright, one more. Oh my gosh. Out of nowhere. I didn't block it? Some of these things are oh, bozo. Sir Aaron, what's good, man? What's good? Professor! Professor Fig! Professor! Bozo! <laughs> this isn't Exposo. good. Exposo. Oh. That was a loading screen. <laughs> where am I supposed to go? Listen, where the lights are going. What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Have you seen? Have you uh, been following this game much, Aaron? Ah, oh, that's I've been where they're leading. Really trying to avoid like spoilers recently. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Protego. Lumos. Once I get a feel for what some of my more useful spells are. Was away from to do it. I need to align these statues with their reflections. Is that it? Perhaps I need to get them all to stand at once. Now I know I did this earlier and Seems they didn't do all that. Choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Okay. Okay. Where oh, dodge that one? Ooh, what kind of nice? With a st stupefy on our attack. Let me see how he does it. Ooh. Let me go ahead and hit one of those real quick. Oh no. There's more. Didn't work like I thought it was going to. Oh. Okay, okay. Aha. Ooh. Boy, too quick for you. 
Oh, <laughs> dude just puts a sword in my bag. Wait, pause. Hold up. Oh. Review objectives. Okay. Okay, I gotta do it one more time. I'm getting caught up in over here trying to. Okay, cool. Cool, buddy. Alright, that's three. Alright, dude. Get out of here. You're so bad. You're so bad at this game. We out here. Lumos. I'm going Lumos up real quick. When we get done with this mission, I'm going to change the keybinds here. I'm make them a little easier on my, my fingers. My little sensitive fingers. Lumos. Rebellion. did you what is this place i don't know but i found this floating above that basin that is no mere basin that is a pensive for viewing memories i wonder Follow my lead. All is in place. The port key is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were it all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. Uh, I'm not sure if he did. 
Is that something you heard, or are you just wondering? That. Just I don't think I've heard that. Give me whatever it is you found here, and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they had the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I, I might be interested I in looking that up that after this. The instructions to vault 12 yeah, you're right, though. He does kind of sound clear. like it, now that you mention it. Sir, I, I must insist. There was like five different voices I could have picked from. Only to one with the key. This was like the and second to last key visible. Well. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? Bad guy. I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Oh my gosh. Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Oh, she. I had to do like a whole thing online to like link my Harry Potter account and my Warner Brothers account to get like some items. And I took like this little test or whatever on the phone, like sort of like um that places you in a certain house and gives you a certain wand also. I'm sure if I played the game normally, it would have done that anyways, but this I I don't know. Can you guess what house I'm getting? House might be placed in. If it's the same one as I did online, then. Before we get into this next mission, I'm going to change some keybinds. Oh, good. We have I'm dropping the mad frames right now. My bad. I'm no Slytherin. Okay, okay, that okay. What makes you say that? Appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can. It but seems when the I game loads a new area, my frames drop. They need to know hard. what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Phineas, Nigellus, Black. 
Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. I'm gonna fix. I'm gonna fix this a nice little bit after this game. Us. I know my friends the are dropping hard right now on stream. Over. There were it's telling me it is complications. Complications. It seems the goblin Enough. problem has goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm gonna fix <clears> that for this. Touch. It seems to be in the cutscenes mostly, and not in the gameplay yet. Which is weird. Like, this right here is dropping a lot. Professor Weasley! We've one more to be sorted. <laughs> I'm gonna try to fix it after this. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Because clever, determined, ambitious are Slytherin traits, which you actually okay. I see that. See, when I was reading through them, I was like, I could see myself as Slytherin, but I saw myself as another one too. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't Holmes, you? Holmes, what are you thinking? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Mmm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. Just pick a house. Your professors if you're familiar with them, if not, then I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> as well. mm. Oh, but you're brave at heart. Exceptionally daring. Undaunted by the unknown. Willing to forge ahead alone. Homo sapiens. <laughs> Perhaps you belong in Gryffindor. That's exactly what I got in the test. I'm going to do this one. Better be Gryffindor! My bad, guys. My bad. I see it, like, in-game. and I know it's fucking up the stream. Just As soon as we get through these cutscenes, I'm going I'm to change some things. Fix it up a little bit so it doesn't happen as often. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes <laughs> begin tomorrow. Yep. I said... I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. This guy's a menace. God, dude, my game is... Ugh. Dude, I, I wish I could change my settings right now, but I have to skip these cutscenes. Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I don't know why the cutscenes are so bad right now. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As deputy headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's not even that I'm dropping frames on stream. It's more so the game is dropping it. It's most and like the, the game, my, uh, my OBS video. isn't encoding it fast enough. I need an to I'm looking forward to it. I'm going to try one thing first. I'm going to try... I entered the Gryffindor common room after being sorted. You were a Gryffindor. I am a Gryffindor. Never could remember the password when I was a girl, however. Password? Password? The password is Grata Domum. Grata Domum. You may enter. Grata Domum. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. 
You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Looks like everyone's gone. All right. Let's head to the common room. Let's try to fix some things real quick. I know, I know. The game is lagging hard as though right now. It's not even, it's just strictly single player. So you couldn't even play with them, honestly, if you wanted to. Y'all just be playing by yourselves. There's, it's no multiplayer in it. I would definitely be playing it by having kept up with it, bro. Answer your question from earlier. Okay, I thought you just didn't hear me or you just didn't want to answer me. It was one or the other. <laughs> Alright, we'll see how these graphic settings feel. They, they think the game looks really good without upscaling right now. But if we start lagging a lot, we'll probably go back to DLSS. And put it on balanced. And if that still lags, we'll just turn off ray tracing. I just have to deal with it. Is there anything I can grab in here? Revelio. Lumos. Lumos. Doesn't look like there's anything I can like really pick up in here. Mine's on sale. Yeah, that's not bad. This is what spell casting. It looks good, man. The game looks really good on PC. Lumos. Plays really well. I gotta get in some fighting, dude. Fighting is fun too. So find your common room. Which way is the common room? Rebellion. There's a little thing up there, you see that? My cap it at 60. We're dropping a lot. Once we get this all sorted, it won't be as bad. This chest. Place. I don't have anything. Oh, perhaps I should. Let's see what I she's up to. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. It's not a complicated spell. I should be able to do it non-verbally. Why is this not working? Oh. Oh, hello there. Welcome to Gryffindor. I'm Cressida. Pleasure to meet you, Cressida. Splendidly theatrical How's the fam? arrival oh, we're doing to the sorting good, man. ceremony we're starting, last like, evening. Crib training by recently. The skin of your teeth. She's been sleeping. Is it true that your professor sleeping thinks soundly? I have her on the baby camera right now. She's uh she's been sleeping a lot longer. Rocky's getting more sleep too. We're chilling now. Ready to go to Tampa, that's for sure. Aaron, did I ever tell you I'm moving to Florida? I don't remember if I told you or not. Bro, chill out. These are high schoolers or something. <laughs> I studied with him. I'm not sure I'd say that, but I did a study with him and Aaron's before creepy. we arrived. Blast! I was hoping he might have given you some advice on non-verbal casting. 
Is that what you were trying to do? Just I'll now? leave in September. Yeah, dude, I'm uh, I'm, I'm actually oh, just waiting yes. at this point. Having a spot of trouble. Can't I've wait. mastered the charm oh. using its incantation. Can't wait to be by this the beach, by the stadium. Send Kelly snaps and be like, "Look at the stadium." <laughs> Your casting needs work or should i say perhaps you just need a bit more practice i'd say your wand work could be a bit more fluid i my wand work is fine thank you i can cast spells more complicated than this one without speaking i'm going to I'm tampa going florida to keep at september it. this year that's where i'm moving Is it really that difficult to cast them verbally? Oh, yes. And if you don't get it just right, the results can be, shall we say, awkward. Once, I tried to cast Depulso non-verbally on a goblet in the Great Hall and ended up launching Professor Sharp's Yorkshire pudding into his face. He was not happy. <laughs> you love Danpo? Do I'm so excited. Just go ahead. Well, good luck with it. Let's go ahead. It was nice be. to meet you, Cressida. You as well. Enjoy your first day. So, Louis, what do you think? This does this look good without the upscaling? Right now, it's good. It might have been earlier. It, try to hit the live button. Is when I change those settings, it dropped a lot. What was the notification I just got? One second. Dude, why is this in my screen? Get out of here. trying to find my uh notification something just happened someone did someone follow or subscribe or something <sighs> it's not updating over here but i heard the the light the noise for it all right let's see what she's doing up here who doesn't know you think she is get anyway the first day. Every year. <laughs> Why is everyone so highly strung? It's perfectly safe. <laughs> well, hello. Don't mind me. I find it helpful to change my point of view now and again. Put things in perspective. Once I made it to the top of Gryffindor Tower, from the outside, without a broom. Goodness. <laughs> I'm Nellie, by the way. Nellie Ogspire. I've heard rumors about what happened to you on your way to Hogwarts. Is it true? Okay. About the dragon. Dang, Aaron, you, you, you had just now solved what? <laughs> I wonder if it's gonna update if I have to fix that later after the stream. Appreciate the sub, me. Yes, our carriage was attacked by a dragon. Crikey! I can't believe it. How thrilling! And oh yeah, how do y'all like the uh, the thumbnail? Anyway, you've certainly brought Aaron so much needed excitement to Gryffindor, and Hogwarts for that matter. What exactly are the rumors about my journey to Hogwarts? Uh, that you escaped a dragon attack? <laughs> Isn't that enough? Most of us arrive via train or boat, not having just escaped the jaws of a dragon. Of course it's got people talking. Word travels fast at Hogwarts. Shav got me on the big screen. What's good, Shav? I'd imagine most students have never seen a dragon. Have you? Goodness, no. And I'd never heard of one attacking a carriage like that. Not enough meat in a carriage, I'd think. Did you see the, uh... Did you see the, uh... Anyone see the new, um... Am I thinking of the thumbnail? I'm sure I'll be seeing you around, either in our common room or when you scale your next tower. <laughs> you never know. Bye for now. I just want to explore. Or what is she? What's her deal with being up there? No, but what's in here for real? I think I need a spell or something for Rebellion. this. It'll be the next Butterbeer. Sure, you don't want to try it? Brewed it myself. 
Mm-hmm, sure, accidentally. <laughs> make sure you hit the uh, live button Pleased so you make sure you. that I'm you're uh, up to date with the stream. Heard about your travels here? Can't believe it. Glad you and Fig are all right. Is it true that someone from the Ministry was with you in the carriage? Oh, uh, yes. A friend of Professor Fig's. Oh, didn't mean to pry. Nasty business, dragons. Again, very glad you're here. Thank you, Gareth. <laughs> so am I. Are you related to Professor Weasley? I am. She's my aunt. Must be nice having an aunt for a professor. You'd think so, wouldn't you? Aunt Matilda tends to treat me as if I'm a first year. Keeps too close an eye on me. It's all a bit suffocating, to be honest. Still, she means well. And she's an incredibly powerful witch. She'll have your back. Are you having butterbeer for breakfast? Hmm? Oh, no. I've been perfecting a recipe I came up with over the summer. I'm almost there, based on some reactions that may need a bit more work. I haven't played many recently made story mode games, but I feel like this one has faces down packed, like, especially like these interactions between different play like other uh, students and stuff. The faces look so good. Well, it was nice meeting you, Gareth, and thank you for the insight. I just played The Witcher own. again Pleasure recently. Pleasure to meet you as well. Good luck and today. It looks good. You could. And you I played the updated door. version, it's fine. But like the, 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 the way the face moves looks more natural here, I'd say, for sure. Let's go explore a little bit more. Meet Professor Weasley outside of the common room. Where is that? How do we get there? Do you go upstairs, maybe? I think. I suppose I'm not allowed. Oh my gosh. I tried to go up the stairs and I go. I can't go up there. Yeah, it just sends me down. Okay. Level lock. Okay. Oh, this is pretty cool. Trying to figure out how to get outside at this point. This is where I'm pretty sure that's where we started. <laughs> oh wait, this might I don't know where I'm at right now to be honest. I feel pretty lost. Let's go up the stairs. Bro, where am I? I can't be this early in the game. I'm already lost. Right, so let's, let's go back down here real quick. Can I go through here now? Oh, now it lets me through. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. You see this ghost just floating through the hallway right now? Here you are. Is that normal? What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. 
You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. This way. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic. She's trying to and teach me something. Let me go see which guy. Let's go learn something real quick. I she a bad enough for real though. You're not even lying. She doing that strut. All right. Portrait of the buff Barofio. Barofio. The portrait. He once said S instead of F and found himself on the floor with a buffalo on his chest. The field guy challenge. Your progress. Field guide challenges are the only way to acquire experience points for XP. Okay. This is your wizarding level. XP earned for challenges increasing your wizarding level. The field guide tracks your current challenge progress and then selects the menu continue. Collecting your first page unlocks you a new challenge. Collect field guy pages in Hogwarts. Rewards must be claimed from the challenge menu. All right, I'll see you later, Professor Weasley. Let me see. So do I uh, click? Do I click this? Gear appearance reward Hogwarts. I I guess I have to finish this to get the reward or something. Okay. Clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that inside and This ghost. It's like all up in my screen. Okay, this cat. Revelio. Ooh, we can lockpick over here. Can we do it right now? No time to waste. You've classes to attend. Hold up, I'm trying to explore. Thirty. Thirty coins. Dang, okay, just jump in front of me. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker. Blue flames. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Fast travel point. You can open the world at any time. Fast travel to any discovered flu flames. All right, cool. Let's do it. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. All right. In this view, you can see the flu flames available in the region. Green flu flames represent the ones you discovered, including your own house. Okay. Oh, we can rotate the building. Okay. Was I supposed to go to that one? I hope so. Is the is the uh, stream still here we are. lagging? Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. 
Now I drop some frames going to this cutscene, but you can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station. So to speak. Good, Connor. What's good, mate? That should be all okay, for better. now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you. Trying to you go fight some of the mentors. Hold up. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story <laughs> I just, I just, than a search for belongings snap, and an extended trip yeah, up to the castle. It's out now. <laughs> if you, if you pre-ordered the game, the deluxe edition, you get three days early access, which is today. Well, it's the 7th. Um, and then if you buy the regular edition, you'll get it on the 10th. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well... I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Speak of the devil. If you haven't already, make sure Professor you hit the little like button, please. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of How spellcasting. How much is it? Regular version, oh, I think it's like 60 to 70. I'm all the credit there, Professor. And... They have a rare... Deluxe edition is 780, but I mean... Hmm. The only point well, you'd begin the deluxe edition now after Perfectly is good boats and carriages mostly for the cosmetics that it gives you to fly in the path of a dragon. and uh i wouldn't say i chose the two days early access because Professor. the first day is already pretty much Although over unfortunately it would seem that it chose us Very so well. if you care if you don't care about Enough those things then you might as well just get, the, get this regular myself. edition on the 10th might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the it's only single player though it's not multiplayer of course thank you a lot of people think it's uh good luck today. i've seen a lot of people thinking it's and remember to it's use not. your field guide it will be invaluable to you and invaluable to me as i'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress yes professor come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today and i'll explain more about those assignments i mentioned and we'll see if we can't get you to hogsmeade for those supplies i'm actually so glad this game is finally I remember playing, there was a Harry Potter game that came out on on the computer a long time ago. It was like on the CD where I put it in the computer disc or whatever. Quest area. And, um, yeah, it came out back then. And you could do actually quite a few things. I don't remember the spell casting in that game, how it was. I don't think, it, definitely not anything like this. Wait, did this page just fly out as soon as I casted the spell? Can I catch it? I did hit it. And you could do like, there was like the little racing game where like you jump through the hoops. Um, not jump, but you fly through the hoops on like on the Griffin door or whatever. Or not Griffin door, the little Griffin uh, mount. It's good to see you, Professor. It was and a very you, like bare bones game, but it was really fun. paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? Yes, sir. But I didn't tell her anything else about her travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. 
Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the it's clever enchantment we included 2 in the field right now, guides so she's asleep. Unfold Sage is also. <laughs> um, that's not, she, she said she would watch it. I don't know if she will or not during the day, like watch the live stream. Um, but yeah, Harry Potter fans, I don't even play her. Dude, yeah, if you're a Harry Potter fan at all, even probably watching gameplay of this is probably exciting to you, I would imagine. Because this is 100 years before Harry Potter. So this like goes into like before what happened during those times. Um, trying to pay attention to this a little bit. Defense against the Dark Arts class. You can go to learn Levioso. Let's go learn that real quick. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead. What with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your. Has the game own been one. pretty good for you on your You'll end, Aaron? Enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional Performance was like normal lagging. Friend. I hope I they fix some of it. When I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Welcome to Hogwarts. Let's go ahead and check that off real quick. You can get these gloves, it looks like. Let's go to that. Charmed compass. I think what I might do is put this game on high on stream. What else am I missing? Uh, I have no drip at all. What the heck? <laughs> Debating like how much quest driven do I want to be in this game versus exploration. I think once we get through like some of these beginning quests, once we like make it to the outside world, we'll explore it a lot more. Is that all you've got? Levioso! Professor Hecate! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in Eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today, we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso? A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprise uh -huh. opponent is a wizard Teach him. opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Steady your one. Oh, yeah, I gotta learn a new spell now. Uh, 
Levioso. Levioso. Okay. Natural. Now, let's try something a little larger. Let us begin with a basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, Levioso. Now, the basic cast. Well done. Very good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Levioso. This should be easy. You're good. Now, perceptive. Wait, why can't I Thank hit him you. with it? Put, put the work on them. <laughs> oh yeah, he's doing flips now. Who's doing flips in there? He's... for a beginner. You give as good as you get. All right, buddy. You ain't tough. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Gryffindor. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing. But battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. All right, that's enough spectacle for one day. Class is dismissed. Class is dismissed. One second, sorry. I knew she was gonna wake up here soon. We'll see if she stays away. Okay, I'm gonna put it right down for a second. Nice work. I enjoyed that. All right, well, I'm that play. duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice. It felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way, didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel.
I'm going to keep an eye ear out for her and watch this camera. I've jeweled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Huh, fair enough. You owe me an honest jewel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned jeweling organization. <laughs> Sounds suspicious. Unsanctioned? I don't know. School rules are in place for a reason. Yes, to keep students in the dark. So many things we're deemed unprepared to know. This is typical Slytherin behavior. Out of your time at Hogwarts, Don't fall for it. You're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Typical Slytherin behavior. Entrance. If we should you're have, interested. What, what could have expected more from Till next time. Go on. Collection updated. Legendary gloves. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. How do we do this one again? I forgot. We just hit it. Lumos. Revelio. There's something I did to this, right? Lumos. It was a certain spell. Rebellion. Leviosa, Luminos. Am I crazy? Why your character look like that? What do you mean? Like the the, the scarf and all that? You don't like my drip? Yo, how do you do these? I always like to see like what they're doing these these pictures. Lumos. Marvelous healer, apparently. Very highly regarded. But... Does anyone remember how we <laughs> did those? Did the um the fast travel? I don't remember how we initiated it. I thought we casted a spell on it or something. I asked him to cast a Professor Ronan tends to go on a bit. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Some of us don't necessarily. There's so much going on in this castle. There's so much. Should we quest? Yeah, let's go and do it. Here, behind you, there is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello. I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of chant. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge, right? Now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? 
Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are, and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will oh. be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. All right, so now we gotta learn Accio. I messed up. I need to take space a second time. Akio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me! Ah. <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree, hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? So why don't we have our newest students start us off, hmm? Eh? 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 <laughs> Very simply, cast Akio on one of the spheres. Very good! How do I stop it? Worry. Now, uh, think of this like God. Excellent control there. I'm a natural. This is easy. Two for three Very on the first good. try? Points to Gryffindor. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Let us see this. Dang, on her first one? Okay, okay, okay. Can I knock hers off? Phew. Imagine Splendid. I knock it off. This is like that one game pe old people play on the like cruise ships. For shuffleboard. This is just like that. Yes. Ah Give me that. I will get you back for that. Uh huh. Okay. What well, you say? She ain't gonna do it. The weak shot. I just gotta get to fifty. I win. That is how it's done. Akio. Ooh, 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 ooh. It happens to the I still win. I still win. 
Got a little bit too cocky right there. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Oh, okay, okay, <laughs> I think okay, we are okay. well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. I'm trying to this push round me off the board. settles it all. Let us see this. What? Oh, I thought I was going to knock it forward more. There we go. Let's see, my objective is to play hers. Let me see. I might just gave her 50 right there. Uh, Very good. Close. I almost gave her 50. I didn't even think about it for a second. Here we go. She might give me 50 right here. Phew. Think I could slide this one over and get 50? Oh, come on. Nicely done. I... All right, all right, all right. That is how it's done. You got this one right here. Akio. Come on, come on, get the, get over. Is that it? Is that fifty? Control there. A natural. Even though I probably gave her more points than she should have had. Very good, both of you. Well done. Dude, these loading scenes. These loading scenes really mess with the stream Passes a lot. Dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Thank you, but I've been holding my own. I appreciate your confidence. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the stream. largest wizarding school in the world. What's good? What's good? Say what's up in the chat if you knew. So yes, bigger yeah. than Hogwarts. Don't forget to hit like button, But it please. never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. Wow. <laughs> you can call Surely the magic is weaker in Uganda. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if have one is without Have I ever wand. seen anyone I in... must admit, however... Use that I am growing quite fond of magic? using a wand. It seems very dramatic. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but oh, I'm glad to be here at Hogwarts. No, I just thought you gone there ah, when I read it. I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. You better not keep him waiting. Until next time. Of course. You can use Akio on humans, if you're so inclined. After my brother learned this, well, you'd be using it on clothes. Uh, excuse me, no, I was better. talking to her. You know it won't work on okay, humans. Okay, well, short conversation. You wanted to speak with me, Professor. I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation. Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor. 
Though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Mm. So wondering, do I get those gloves I, I saw earlier and uh Akio. Dang. My fault. Professor Ronan reminds me of my grandfather. Loads of wisdom, but a bit mad. Really, dude? Don't talk about him like that in his classroom? Let's see what's up here real quick. Let me in! Chef! <laughs> Bro, I hope you're in the stream right now. <laughs> Oh, I'm dead. Oh, shit. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Uh. Hello. You wanted to speak to me? Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day is going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I can't count on beginner's luck to impress Professor Ronan. You think Gareth Weasley would be better at transfiguration? What is this? Another cat. We have to pet every cat we pass, by the way. So just prepare yourself. Oh my gosh, another one. Dude, they're everywhere. Why are there so many cats here? Bro, what are you doing? Wait, what? Unicorn? Uh, perhaps mind what you're doing there. Where is the unicorn at? I'm trying to understand this. It's a triangle with numbers three, five, zero. Revelio. I don't even, that just worked. I didn't even know that was going to happen. House fanatic. I think I got this when I was doing the count thing. But this is actually really cool. Like the design on it. I didn't think that was going to do all that when I pre-ordered it. I thought it was just like. Some basic stuff. Nah, 
How we dripped out? Ain't no one can say something to me now. Sheesh. Oh yeah, I forgot about this door. I don't even know what to do about it. This makes no sense to me. Okay. Question mark three zero five. That's seven, right? Two. How do I know what two is? All right, because if you add all these up, right, three, two, zero is five. That's how I'm thinking. But do these like represent a number? Same thing with this one. Why does this have two question marks? I thought Professor Black would get rid of all the muscle born students. Too much talk. All right, we'll, we'll re-attack this I've later. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. I also want to remember how to do this because maybe I'm missing something. Is there any way I can revisit the <laughs> how to do it? <laughs> I really want to know how did I do this? How did I forget so easily? Watch what you're doing. Who, who, who are you talking to? You see me in my drip? Akio, off on another adventure, are we? Levioso. Lumos. <laughs> Rebellion. Dude, I did something to activate this little thing earlier, and I forgot what it was. Dang. Just came from here. But you look suspicious. Well, aren't we the loveliest of them all? And I don't say things I don't mean. Rebellion. Oh, chess. Oh, don't tell me. That's what is going on in here? Oh, 
Oh man. <laughs> That's crazy. See now the flame activated. See you, my young friend. Why didn't the other one activate? Is it because he sees me or something? Oh, I think I need that cloak, the invisible cloak to open him. Let's go, Karina. What's up, what's up, what's up? Welcome to the stream, Karina. This is where we did the other lesson, right? I think so. Professor Fig, as my as if my schedule wasn't congested enough, the ministry has charged me with arranging the rather inconvenient arrival of a new student of Hogwarts, the fifth year, if you believe. Professor Weasley insists that they can they will need an escort. Dang, why is he hating on me like that? This is the new game? Yeah, this is uh the Hogwarts legacy game. <laughs> Casting spells. I did not mean to break that. Oh, look, that's my friend right here. Crimson winter coat. Two cats. This one looks like a a wild one. Like a leopard. Come on now. I'm gonna pat the other one. Bro, what are you doing? He's over here walking into the wall. That cat was really doing something. I was you like, can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before There's I so much in every room I go to to look at. These kids are just flying through the sky right now. <laughs> wait till that's me. Just wait. I'll be on my broom too. Dude, every time I come out here, it's I drop hard frames. Hell no. Oh wait, I forgot. You can do, cause this one gives me no offense. This one gives me three.
but then I could just change the appearance of it. Select it and then do what I did earlier. Yeah, I can have that one, but still. It's pretty cool. Still have the traits of it. <laughs> I walked outside and these little kids are just flying through the sky. That's hilarious. Let's cap it at 60. Let's do recommended apply. This area seems to be like the most performance demanding area for the computer. It's like a dragon. Let's go back to high real quick. There's a lot of like figuring out what the game should run on recently. I'm gonna look up eventually I'm gonna look up a settings guide. Probably when the game has more guides on it on YouTube. That way they, I can figure out something that works really well. That isn't really laggy. Your video on the stream is probably like lagging really hard. I could try to catch this book. Hold up. Akio. Rebellion. I heard something. Portrait of Sir Cadogan. Sir Cadogan was alleged with his friends with Merlin himself as he became a sworn knight of the round table, although he is really in uh, the wizarding world. Cool. Time for idle chatter. Okay. Any more kids flying through the sky? Bro, I'm actually lost right now. I forgot what I was I forgot what I was doing, to be honest. What is this? For someone who possibly has ADHD, this game is very like promoting of getting lost. Forgetting what your mission was. See, there's another. There's more triangle things over here. I'm supposed to know what this does. Thirteen something snakes. How am I supposed to figure this out? This is ridiculous. I'm gonna figure it out one day. Raven, oh, we're in the Ravenclaw side of the castle. Rebellion. Am I supposed to do something here? Oh! 
I'm really out here. Professional wizard. Oh, look at this little page right here. Let me go and grab this thing up real quick. What? What did it go way over there for? Trying to catch this page. Stairs over here being built in front of me. Where'd that page go? Not this door again. All right, let me see what, what missions I gotta do. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased. <laughs> it's uh, I had this guy who made it. It was so funny. I like having my face in the videos before y'all click them because to new people it's more recognizable. And I was like, bro, I gotta put Harry Potter stuff on my face. How do I get over there? I'm legitimately lost. Oh wait, I'm look I have to look at my map. I'm tripping. Go and just follow the map. Rebellion. Anything around me? Okay, get it. What the heck? Rebellion. Oh, here it is. That's pretty cool. And then there's something with this. In there, I just know it. Hello. I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. You're talking about the mermaids? Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brain long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Do come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that solves the mystery. Lumos. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's All nearby. Right, so a little round guy in the corner under staircase. Revelio. Is that around here somewhere? Wait till I learn how to pick logs. Wait, I just found something. Dusky wool scarf, okay. Let me get out of here real quick. Mm -hmm. 
Rebellion. Do I keep finding these? It's like right around the corner. Is it in here? Nice. Trying to let the game look. Not sure it sent the right message. Does Professor Black have Rebellion. Finding all of these right now. There's another one right here too. It's eight of eight. There was a bunch in that room. It's like fifteen field guide pages for this hat. All right, let's get back on course. Let's go meet Professor Weasley. I just know we were fine. If only. Akio. This looks like the location from the painting. Oh yeah, it is. What could be so special about it? Rebellion. Akio. What do you do with that? Akio. Let me open. Rebellion. It's not there. The butterfly thing. Like, what do you do with this bird thing? This moth. Rebellion. I don't know. That was it. Half a bottle of flabbergasted leech. Stir. What are you up to twice. now? Search this chest for third. I think I gotta meet her upstairs.
Lumos. Oh, that's what it is. Let's get you back the only to one frame, I, little moth. The only thing I didn't do was this spell. Black is without a doubt the worst. <laughs> I knew there was a connection. I should tell the Nora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. <laughs> it just disappears. Where's she at? Is she up there? Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. A pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that, too. So is a meat, although he does tend to over-explain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The moth! I should have seen that! Alright, let's go see what Professor Weasley's doing real quick. Hello, buddy. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Yeah. Ah, there you are. That. I trust your first classes went well. Why he look like <laughs> did? Professor. That's Dobie. I heard as much from Professor's Hecate or Dobby or whatever his name is. Seems Professor Fig taught you I'm quite a bit that. during your brief detour near. This is actually a hundred years before Harry Potter. Some ruins? I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told you know, me. Twenty years. Isn't there? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details. Mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. <laughs> it's not the same guy in the, in the movie. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect oh. wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Salo or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. 
I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Butterbeer? A butterbeer? Speak to Professor Ronan to receive your first assignment. Assignments are you. Professor's one. in here real quick. Revelio. On another adventure, are we? Black only looks out for the smoke. Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed, I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm, Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Rapero in no time. Why must I first complete tasks to learn Repero? No lesson or lecture can compare to first-hand experience, and these tasks should provide you with just that. Such experience is invaluable when mastering any new bit of magic. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. All right, let me see. Collect the flying page near the broken statue, collect the flying page and the defense. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying control is. Got it. A flying page must be around here somewhere. If only a new student was helping. Akio! Brilliant. I trust the preliminary... I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Repetero. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, Repetero. have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. I knew I saw something over here. Here. 
Can you do something with these? I don't want to attack it, but I kind of do. Alright, let me go see. Repair. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> Snakes. All right, let's get to the next quest. Actually swung and hit him. So many interesting people from all over the world come to this auction. Hello, looking for me? Natty, I hope I haven't kept you waiting long. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. You must be eager to have your own things again. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first-rate Hogsmeade experience. I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to accompany you. Really? Yes. I had planned to extend an invitation to Love you. Also. You might enjoy a better be in the village. Do you think anyone can <laughs> The timing of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. I cannot tell you how nice it is to breathe fresh air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. Grave mistake to take it as an elective class, believe me. I believe you. Though I suppose you would not really call it elective when your mother was the one who elected that you take it. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas. But that's one of the few times of year I would rather be indoors. <laughs> not much for the cold, are you? Oh, I do not mind the cold so much. But it has taken some getting used to. I did not grow up around snow. Oh, wait, over here. I often spot lacewing flies in this area. Oh? What's so special about them? They are interesting to look at. But if you stew them, you can also use them in potion making. Leviosa. Accio. Lumos. here repair Accio.
Look, from a forbidden forest. Hippogriff. I wonder if something startled them. I heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs. Absolutely. Likely already named. That's a forbidden forest on the left. It's off limits to students, <laughs> as the name implies. Why is it off limits? The professors claim it is too dangerous. I think that calling it forbidden only makes it more alluring. Ah, there's Hogsmeade over the crest, past that ruin. I would spend all of my time exploring if I could. I confess I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, since you're relatively new here. She said that? Hmm. She knows more about me than I had thought. I will. Well, I certainly learn a great deal in class. Much can be gleaned outside of the castle walls. Me? Not me. She was talking about the little uh, goblin looking dude. How are you settling in? I remember the weeks I followed my arrival yeah. feeling quite strange. Quite strange. Everything was so new and unfamiliar. I'm getting used to things. What about you? Do you finally feel settled? Yes. I still miss my homeland, <laughs> but it is beautiful here too. And getting out of the castle and exploring helped me to adjust quite a bit. Hogwarts has become something of a home now, I would say. Hopefully it will for you too. Should I try to like find parts of the stream and cut it to for a video? Or do you think I should just leave the live streams up like normal? I'm trying to think of like specific moments in the stream Mr. Moon. i guess we do part one part Hogwarts two and stuff like that looks like each stream just specific things like quests Hello, mostly Moon. and like a Have few funny things that we found pleasure um you might want to turn back miss on i uh turn and run is everything all right sir oh it looked right at me eyes big as saucers what did mr moon Jemmy, guys, ugly and airy and mm, terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. Poor Mr. Moon, a Demi guys. I think he had too much fun in the village. I will say that I have never seen him in such a state. A video with highlights? Okay. Good thing about it. That should probably try doing that just so because i know it's hard to rewatch streams because there's a lot of empty I moments of me trying to like, either fix the game the or are, figuring things such, out it might be nice to have a friend it's with important you. for me to try to figure things out like puzzles mind. on doors and Thank stuff you. like that but like it's hard to rewatch that soup soup what's good man welcome to the stream uh what do, i i'm having a great time playing it honestly game looks great too I've had to downgrade my and settings a lot because I was dropping frames on stream, it but to know it still looks stunning. The three broomsticks is the place for butter beer. God, like the, the combat works really well too. I've had fun like fighting things. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything you need in Hogsmeade. And it's like. I, I'll go on a quest most of the time and I get lost like I'm running through the castle and this is my first time getting to this location but I'll be running through the castle I'm like oh what's down here oh what's over here and I'm just like 14 different hallways down nowhere where I needed to be it's great I love it what is she doing 
Professor Weasley said that you need to get potion recipes, spell crafts, some seeds, and... A new wand. Of course. You will enjoy Mr. Ollivander, and I am keen to see what you will do with a wand of your own. You should be able to collect everything you need and still have time to explore a little as well. Experience Hogsmeade at your own pace. We can meet up in the town circle when you are finished. Enjoy yourself. I will see you soon. Hogsmeade Village is brimming with different sites, shops, and points of interest that you can navigate with your field guide map. Okay, let's see that. J. Pippin's Potions. Ollivanders. I do need to go Ollivanders, though. Get my wand real quick. See what my wand is. Come on, let me get my right wand. With. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. He's a, uh, it's you. Uh, mm, hello, sir. I'm looking for, for a new wand. Yes, it's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivanders, the name. This wand is pretty cool, too. But of course. You'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you. Truly. Now, come with me. Let's find you the perfect wand, shall we? Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes. Yes. Hmm. Powerful core. Ten and a half inches? Hmm, you might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Hmm, <laughs> how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Oh dear. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, we'll find you something, not to worry. Mm, no, not you. Uh, uh, mm, perhaps. Yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Let's give this one a try. My gosh. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah there you are. Yes. I think you might be the one. Here, take it. What do I do? Intriguing. Curious indeed. Like this one? You can How change intriguing. it a lot of different ways, actually. Curious indeed. Have you played the game, Sue?
The gray one? How intriguing. Do you mean this one? The white one? Which one was gray? Curious indeed. This one? This one's actually pretty cool. It's all black. How intriguing. Curious I'm between... I like this style, I think. I don't know, this one's pretty How cool. I think I like this one. You can change this. How intriguing. Curious indeed. I think it was Ash, right? Does this actually do anything though? It's a huge one. Twelve and a half. How inches. intriguing. Reasonably supple, unyielding. Kind of bendy. I mean, I'll just leave it how it was, honestly. I don't even know what the difference is here. Curious indeed. The hairy unicorn serves the core of the wand, known for producing consistent magic. Dragon heart string serves as the core of the wand, known for producing powerful magic, capable of producing great a great range of master magic. I think it draw. I think the original one was this one. I kind of want to stick with the original one, besides obviously when I changed the look of it, but. Everything else seemed pretty good, right? A dragon heartstring wand is most powerful and learns quickly. We'll do it. We'll do it. Get our wand. Let's go. Can I purchase it? Oh, I gotta hold it. What do you think? Oh, yeah. We balling now. Look at that wand. Ordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> ah. Now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Nice. Oh, yeah, I think we made a good choice here. Feeling fairly confident now. All right, let's go see outside real quick. Now we have to go visit tomes and scrolls. What else are we near? I'll just go through this one real quick. Is it here? An inquiring mind. What's this? Okay. 
Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Potting table with a small pot, spellcraft, unlocks the ability to conjure a potting table with a small pot, grow all sorts of useful magical plants. Potion brewing needs. And they're both zero, might as well you get both right. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest Beast of my feeder. Adventure. Beast toy box, chopping station. We just sell these, right? Or we just hold on to them. See something. So this one gives me seven defense. It's not bad. We'll put these on. I think we'll keep them on too over the the mask design. This one gives me eight defense too. What do we think? Would we like the hat? Mm. I think we keep this hat actually. Bro, this hat's actually going to be too funny. Revelio. Where's it at? Is it downstairs? Is it outside? Rebellion. Oh, it's right here. Ooh, 
Who is this? Where'd he go? Oh, down here. I like it. Gives me more, uh... This is dress. That's funny. Now we have quite a few stats, right? I wonder how like effective it is. We haven't really been able to fight much at this point, but I know before I was in like threes and fours, so I have to be doing more damage right now. Quests, I need to go Pippin's potions and magic meat. Let's see what we're closer by. So we just go to potions real quick. After this, is it only single player? Yeah, it's only single player. Strictly single player. Honestly, dude, I think this game, like, if they ever do make another like continuation of this series, they made it like. Like a world like this, but with people in it, that would be pretty cool. I'm not sure how much it would tie. Like, who would think? Like MMO? No, maybe. Welcome to J. Pippin's Potions. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness! When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Know that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is Jay Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? Recipe that causes rocky film to develop on the consumer skin and that's pretty cool what made you choose it was i didn't choose it necessarily it was like the first one that was given to me but i mean reading into a few of them i would say yeah that is kind of fitting also feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory or come back another time if you're in a rush today It was like a little like when you're creating the accounts um you had to link them with the warner brothers with the harry potter like something account so i had to create one and then while you're creating it it goes through like a little it's like self-test it's like ask you what do you like what do you like what like different questions and it kind of like i guess scales you i'm not sure like obviously it's just kind of like for fun but it's pretty much where i ended up on there and then when I started the game, I think it read those answers. It gave me the wand and the, uh, what do we call it? The, the, the class or whatever, the house. Oh my god. 
<sighs> this must be 4 a.m. I'm going to sleep here soon. So now we got some new potions. Alright, we'll figure it out, I guess. Eventually. Now we need to cross the bridge. Rebellion. Oh, wrong one. Oh, wrong one. Level three lock. I think I need that little cloak. Get that chest. I just had to see, dude. I've been wondering this whole time what happens if you hit something. Obviously, I guess you don't kill him. I had to see. I'm so curious. All right, now I gotta see. It. <laughs> Bruh. The sheep just fell over. That's funny. It's like a sheep goat with horns. Bring him right back. <laughs> Poor sheep, dude. Okay, I'm done. Let me go see. Where Where is this place? Is this it? There has to be something up here. Why does it look like I can climb this, but I can't? Okay, I barely touched it. Invincible like Skyrim? No, yeah, you're right. And the sheep would not die. God forbid you kill a chicken in that game, though. Where am I going? Okay, let me look at the map. The magic neep. I think transfiguration is the hardest. It's down here, right? Somewhere. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Oh, the Dittany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. My you must be positively just reeling just from it all. Connecting. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dittany seeds? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. These are so expensive. It's like everything I have oh, since everything. I started. Better go and find Natty. Lumos. Let me 
Okay, it's just all animals. Okay, we can't we can't go hunting. Okay, it's fine. It was for science. Repair. That's not what I meant to do. Revelio. Oh my gosh, I did not mean to jump like that. I'm gonna grab this page. So is there is it possible to sneak up on this chest right here? Like How do you crouch? Whatever. Ah, I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Is this the dragon again? Oh my god, no, he's not. Okay, shoot. I'm scrapping out here, hold up. Get a little trusty out real quick. Oh, just pissed him off. It's another one? Get ancient magic from oh, that didn't work. <laughs> she got smacked. Okay, I was just what the heck? Did I just grab him? I think I think I meant to grab the barrel and I grabbed him instead. Okay. We're not doing that no more. I dodged too early. I'm stuck on the wall. Yeah, he literally smashes the shield. <laughs> I dodged like literally a second too early and his GG. Okay, now. Uh Tough than I thought I was gonna be. Oh shoot. Dang. Goodness. 
A second troll? Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I suppose it was so. Loki. He it's was hitting you, and I was to be honest. deep Mervin's away from it. Beard. I was like, "Are you all right?" We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that? The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer, officer Singer, and thank you again. Go to uh, repair okay. real quick. Like that. Repair it. Repair it. Oh, hold on. Give me the page. Anything else he broke? Holy. I didn't even feel like he broke that much at first. Rebellion. Just talking about you. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, uh, Augustus Hill, Clothia Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin, but I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Five offense. What else you got? Received a piece of gear. Current defense, okay. This only have three upgrades though. I guess until I figure out an upgrade, I'll use this one. These aren't actually too bad. Legendary for 500. I'm not gonna buy anything though right now. What an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butter beer. Shall we head to the three broomsticks? Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Just down this way then. 
I sell even more battle-worthy items, should you be inclined. Revelios, you're most welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess might be outside. and a powerful witch. I don't see it. I Good hear it. To know. Rebellion. I wish if I saw it, it would stay there for like a split second longer. So I had to click it again right before I grab it. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who's this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Let's go. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say, <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <coughs> uh, uh, Oh, time lane. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the Theophilus. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. How are you? Make sure you're sticking with the stream. I'll be live tomorrow. If you liked it, please don't forget to hit the like, like button, and I'll catch you all later. Good night. Peace out.